Something really powerful happened to me when I finally chose to let go. Life quickly became very quiet. I had to learn the steps to walking alone. With time, I opened myself up to the world around me in a new way. I gained clarity as my senses became fine-tuned to the natural notes of life that was all around me. I started to notice and appreciate the little things, from the call of an osprey on the wind to the breath of a dolphin amongst a wave. I started to make sense of my connection to all of it. It felt like the earth slowed down just enough for me to catch up. My steps became more intentional. I stopped trying to rush. I wasn't trying to follow life on a straight line anymore. I learned that life is not a destination. It, it's a beautiful, miraculous journey that ebbs and flows. These are the things that you have taught me. You've showed me a world I didn't even know existed. One I didn't know I was allowed to reach for that's filled with love and joy and hope. If I was going to try to describe it, I would say it's the purest sense of what it means to be alive. The question is not, who am I, but what am I a part of? I think that's the biggest secret to life. I am part of this intricate web of intelligence and beauty. It's bigger than me and my individual existence, and that's what makes it so incredible. It's not about how I stand out, but how I fit in, and how I belong to you. <laughs> Wherever I go, whenever I feel lost, I always find my way back to you. I dance with your breeze. I play with your waves. I ground myself in the granules of sand along your beaches. Dear ocean, I thank you. You've gifted me with a life I never thought I was capable of. If I never was to see you again, then I'll remember you as the place where I found God, where I understood that my soul is forever bound to the water. <laughs> <laughs>